What have mommy or daddy told you to do to stay safe when you're out in the world? If it's a busy street, you have to hold your mom or your dad or your brother or your sister's hand. Don't climb on the counter because you might hurt yourself. Do not lick the subway. I cough into my elbow. As parents, we do our best to teach our kids how to stay safe in the real world. But are parents doing enough to keep their families safe online? Identity fraud losses totaled $16.9 billion in 2019. Families with children under 18 are 128% more likely to be victims of identity fraud compared to the average American. And families pay more than twice as much out of pocket as non-families as a result of identity fraud. But there are ways to help reduce the risk of this from happening to your family and still make the most of the internet. 92% of Americans say they care about online safety, but their actions show otherwise. Do you have different passwords for all your accounts? No. It's like a variation of the same one. Have you deleted all the social media accounts that you don't use? No. Yes! Do you use mobile payment apps? I don't trust it. <laughs> yes. I, yes, I do my best. Most certainly not, no. But I know it's more secure, but it's more of a hassle. And I should go numbers and passwords. <laughs> I use my uh, my hands to shred. I tear them up, but not nearly enough as I should. Tear it this way, I'll tear it sideways. <laughs> While we should all be saying yes to more of these questions and practicing safe online habits, many of us aren't. The majority of people use one or a handful of different passwords for all their accounts, and a third have shared their password with others. So why is identity protection important and how can you help keep yourself safe online? Now, does everyone know what a footprint is? Yes. Oh, okay, yes. What would happen if I followed your footprint? You, if I accidentally let footprints to bury treasure, you might have find it a treasure. Yes, that's exactly it. Now, when mommy or daddy log on the computer to maybe order the pizza, or suppose you watch a movie together, they give the company information about them and the company remembers it. It's like leaving a footprint on that website. And that's what's called a digital footprint. Sometimes bad people follow other people's footprints steal secret information, and steal their money to buy a hundred pizzas, all for themselves. Is that okay? Do you think that's right? No, that's not okay. Just like when we're crossing the street, there are things that we can do to help protect ourselves and stay safe. Protecting your family online is easy when you know how to identify and manage the risks of identity fraud. Allstate Identity Protection lets you see the online accounts that have your info and alerts you if your data may have been breached or misused so that you can take action. In a world where it can take between 100 hours to six months to fix the effects of identity theft, Allstate Identity Protection offers 24-7 customer service, fraud remediation support, and identity credit and social media monitoring. It also offers an identity fraud expense reimbursement of up to $1 million. Look around. It's easy to see why online safety is so important. Class dismissed.